Hi everyone. Welcome to Pokemon Uranium. Ooh, that's cool. <laughs> um, you're now seeing my fifth time recording this. Because foolishly, I decided to uh, record an OBS before actually seeing if the footage was good. And then I tried again using a different set of settings than OBS, which also didn't work. And then I got a different setting. I got I got a different system. To record games, but for whatever reason, the audio is completely blocked up, making uh, the footage completely unusable because I'm blasted out by the Pokemon music. And I kind of cut Uranium off for a little bit, I didn't know how I was going to go back and record it. Uh, I looked at the Pokemon in the game and decided that yes, I have to do a full LP just because I like the Pokemon so much. Um, which is why. Uh, the game crashed while I was recording the intro. I digress. I don't know if I should count this as my fifth or sixth time recording, but suffice it to say that I have done quite a lot. I actually already made a character, but I'm going to make a new save. Now, I'm rather fed up with reading this because I've actually read it twice now in takes that didn't get seen, and I hate this idiot's design. His name's Banpo. If you find that the parent pronounce, just call him the Pokemon Professor. It's this, it's like this in every game. Oh god, I shouldn't have said yes. Oh dear me. I'm gonna try to not swear in this series. That's the challenge for it. You know, not a Nuzlocke, I just can't say the... the big words. Oh my god. No, I don't. You know, it's a Pokemon game. It's one of the things where it's kind of weird that this is a Pokemon game. They made so much original content for it that it really doesn't even need to be one. It doesn't have to be considered a Pokemon game. And it being a Pokemon game made it harder to get it, because Nintendo uh, hit him up with a little C and D, you know what I'm saying? Naturally, this was the main issue. Last time I was the non-binary one, and I would pick that if their sprite wasn't kind of ugly. So I'll just, I'll be a boy. Alfred. Yeah, it's Alfred. You ready? No, but let's go anyway. Ten years ago, Alfred's fan lived in Beach Ball City, biggest city in Tandor. Their father, Arden, was a edgelord. Their mother, Lucille, was a nuclear physicist or whatever. They worked demanding jobs, and they always found time to be perfect parents. Tanner was at peace, and Lucille was doing nuclear power. The future seemed great, until the meltdown. It was an ordinary day, full of ordinary people. Lucille was doing stuff. A routine inspection, they brought a guy in to look at the sis. Finish your diagnostics? I have. Everything's working perfectly. The generator design does its job well. Good. Excellent. If everyone's finished their lunch, we'll break for work. Boss, you might want to take a look at this. I'm not doing the voices because I just recorded four videos and my voice is very tired. Um, and because I've already read this twice. Uh, so I'm a little... irritated. The temperature readings are higher than normal. Either we need to shred the thermometer or... The reactor is leaking heat. Well, it gave me the thermometer, I just checked it. So. I don't know what it is about these Pokemon fan games, but a lot of them have issues with skipping text. Must be breaking the reactor. A few minutes while total meltdown. It's going critical, oh no! I hate it when reactors go critical. Everyone needs to get the heck of out of here. Lucille, your anime hair will die in the burn. 
Well, I guess I'll leave now. A green blast. With Camo's help, all the scientists got out except Lucille. She was never seen again, but she's definitely still alive because people can't die in Pokemon games. The radiation leak around the broken reactor made it into Chernobyl for a couple of years. They built a giant sarcophagus. By the way, if you guys don't know about that, they built a giant thing over uh, Chernobyl after the reactor. The loss of his wife had a uh, profound change on Talion. He became a ranger, he got promoted, and he couldn't care for his baby. Alfred got sent away to live with their auntie in Moki Town. Ten years passed. I thought this was ten years ago. Honestly, this is this is just two writers. Do one or the other. Supporting a child was too much work for her. Ernest Bambo, the local professor, was looking for an assistant. Two kids applied. Alfred and their childhood f friend, Theo. The Pokemon plot happened. You're late. I'll just rush downstairs. Yeah, this sprite looks a lot better. Cup of Joe. Today's your big day. Can't help seeing Glum, seeing my little one grown up and leaving home. If only these old bones could do more than it could support us both. I know you're ready for this. You and Theo have been so capable of wonder about him. He's younger, after all. I'm sure his father Cameron wouldn't allow him to go if he wasn't sure. Celebrity Jay, I got your present. Open it. We got running shoes. To run, hold Z. Toggle the auto run to the menu. Sniff. Don't mind me, sweetie. I'm an emotional old lady. If your father were here right now, well, I'm sure he's probably used to. I'm positive we'd run into him during your adventure. And your mother, or perhaps her ghost. Say hi to that handsome professor, will you? He's not handsome, Grandma. He's ugly. Stop by after you get your pokes. Alright, actually. Now that I'm here. Now, if I change the screen size. So, for some reason, the FPS is set to 40 at the minimum instead of anything else. If I change the screen size, it will just uh, stop the recording. Those all look good. I'm gonna save the game. Oh, it's Sunrise. That's nice. That's very pleasant. I noticed that a lot of Pokemon YouTubers actually uh, play games at the dark because they it's night when they record. Gonna be the breadwinner. I should pop by to date your aunt now again. Go ho ho, says Waldorf. Most of the pokes are native, but there's some which can be found in other regions, like in Gen 1 and Gen 3. This, by the way, is a mostly Gen 1 and 3 game, for those of you who don't know. That essentially means that, um, Pokemon games are split into generations, for those who don't know. Um, this loosely means by console. That's not always true, because there were uh, a couple games on the same... Oh, excuse me, sorry, I just had to read something. There were a couple of games on the same system. Like, the DS got more than a few, the 3DS technically got more than a few, but essentially, whenever a big up update comes out, then that's the new uh, generation of Pokemon. Gen 1 pokes are in nearly every game. Um, Gen 5 was controversial because it didn't allow Pokemon from any other generation for a while. Gen 8, the most recent one, was also controversial because it still doesn't have any other Pokemon from other areas. Gen 7 is the only one I have beat. Gen 3 is my favorite one besides 7. I like Gen 4, although I think it's the weakest of them all. Gen 2 is better than Gen 1. Um, Gen 1ers get too much credit. And that's really all I've got to say about that. Um, that's where I am right now. For those who don't know. Uh, and the reason I say this is so people know... How, how I uh, approach how I approach Pokemon. Um, I like Gen 6. Um, despite how much I hate France, I actually like France. And so I like that Gen 6 is based off of France. Um, and just so you know, yes. 
I am in fact stalling for time because I'm looking at the Pokedex because I'm not sure which one I want. You know, I don't really like many of the starters, so I'll go something a little controversial. Wait up. I'll go with the grass starter, I think. Actually, I haven't gone with a water starter in a while. This is Theo. He's our annoying friend. He's more annoying than the idiot in Gen 4. Hey, it's you guys. Right, yeah, you guys. It's a special day. First day as research assistants. So I've already played this, so I know how it works. Um, you take the test. The patat. Different Sparta Pokemon are better for different battling styles. So instead of just picking them... Sorry if I'm skipping through these too fast. Yeah, I'm ready. So, normally I would attack it, but in this one, I will throw a Pokemon. Oh, shoot. I want to make new friends. Honestly, what I really want is to get all three of them, but I don't really like any of them. But honestly, the one that I haven't seen is the uh, water Pokemon. I've seen, um, I got the fire Pokemon in my last run, although they didn't really go anywhere. And uh, I've seen the grass Pokemon in a video I looked up to like examine if this game seemed interesting. But I haven't seen the water Pokemon at all. Alfred, you're a trainer capable of many strategies. You prefer to adapt to overcome challenges. Your philosophy is just go with the flow. Your rational approach will aid you. Elect us. Cool. Oh? Okay. Take it. Alright. Should we reset? No, I'll just stick with my decisions. It probably doesn't matter too, too much anyway, right? Hmm. Let's name him Bolty. Hey, I'm an annoying character. Where do I get my stuff? Hmm. Theo, you're stupid, so you get the stupid Pokemon. The way that the background and the lights freeze are really, really annoying me. I hope the recording's okay. Raptorch is the best pick. My poke. You know what this means. No, I'm gonna add. Stock sound effect. Eh, the sprite's a little better. Oh, who would like to battle? No, hold Alright, so before we do this, I'm going to check the recording and make sure that this is still alright. So, I'll be back in a second. Hey, and we're back. Bolty's just gonna kick the the dirt out of this dude. Actually, can we? No. Okay. Can we just lose? It's not effective. Because normally, if you win this fight, uh, he gets really upset. And I'm not doing a nuzlocke or anything, so I don't feel really bad about losing this fight. I lose friendship, but I just got the thing. Not really too easy to march, right?
I want to see how deep it goes, you know? does kind of annoy me is that it makes my microphone kind of sound like garbage, which is uh, not what I paid a hundred thousand dollars for. You got a crit, there you go. Multi died. <laughs> I had money? Pokemon and me are going to be the best? You're nothing. Nothing. I'm going to trash you later, kid, you know? I'm surprised you managed to lose that fight. You must know she started as a type advantage. Here's the rock, paper, scissors. It is kind of me, as a matter of fact. He doesn't take it so well, I've seen the future. Let me heal your stuff. Going out to the entrance, teach you how to catch pokes. Okay. All in all, I like that better. Can't wait to start getting the Pokemon, though. Right, I forgot about that. Yeah, now look at me, I'm hauling it. He was in a good mood. He showed me a start to poke and how proud he was to beat you. He didn't take it too hard, he's energetic, and he's heart set on winning. Did you let him win on purpose? I did. I guess I should thank you. Guys will begin his journey on a high note. He'll have a rough time when he encounters his first loss. Not everyone will go easy on him like you did. And then I think that dialogue's the same. Your father, Carolyn, sent me these and told me to give them to you when you began your journeys. I'm sure it'll come in useful. It's an iPod. What's that? Well, let me tell you. It plays music. And it contains a phone, so it's also an iPhone. Alright. Starting a new job, supervising power plant Epsilon. But I'll see you there. It's the last place your dead mother was ever seen alive, now that she's dead. Yeah, there's just this, like, sort of jank that's present in a lot of these, uh, fan-made Pokemon games. I don't know what it is. I honestly think that it must be something with the engine, because as far as I know, they're all made in the same... Pseudo RPG Maker? Or Pseudo, excuse me. Don't ask a long story. Nope, that's the wrong way. I already went that way. Hello, Karen. You're leaving home. Here, take this. Oh, that's good. I'm glad I got that, actually. <laughs> that reminds me. There's probably a potion in my room. See you later, Grandma. Yep, there you go. There usually is. It's a Wii U. I hear they're making a Switch soon. They are, and it'll be better. Thanks, Grandma Auntie. Beaten any gym leaders yet? I did. Shut up, Cranky Kong. Alright. I've been a little low energy because uh, I recorded a bunch of other videos, but I'm ready now. Now that you're here, it's time to begin your lesson as a poke trainer. Watch closely. I know more than you, you know. You can find them everywhere else, if you know where to look. Tall grass is your best bet. Take these steps in. It's a ch chin monk. It's common. 
I haven't noticed me, so now's my chance. Go Warchanks. Oh, he has the last one. That's kind of funny, actually. Yeah, there you go. This is the other starter Pokemon you could receive. I'm gonna keep him. Now, the next step is to weaken him to make him easier to catch. Scratch the thing. I would love a Pokemon game where it's like, hey, you played Pokemon. Go. Hi, welcome to the world of Pokemon. What starter would you like? Great. Now go. I'm the Pokemon professor that studies gun jumping and rushing into things. I got your Pokemon. What's your name again? Go. These are for you. A Pokedex. That Pokedex is an encyclopedia that'll do whatever. It's important, so make sure to fill it out as much as possible. Is that an error? Um, I know for a fact that this game is apparently not being updated anymore, according to the developers, and it's probably because they were like, hey, uh, we're getting C&D from the big N. Alright, we got Pokeballs. Gotta catch them all? No wonder you guys got C&D. Pokedown doesn't have a Poke Mart. Kevlar Town on the other side of Route 1 does. Lesson's over. Disturbed Professor Bamboo. I might have special rewards if you get more pokes. Best luck. I don't care you got the strongest starter. I'm gonna be the best trainer ever. Does he know? You're never gonna win again, just so you know. I'm going to rinse you. Alright. Give me my encounter. Give me my encounter. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Interesting. Does this grass not give encounters? The professor- There we go! Jeez. It's on the teeny link. Go, Baldy. He's going to... Let's put a stab on us and just shoot water gun. See how it goes. Well, Chimney Mignonk suddenly did something. And then let's tackle it. Grab it. Okay. I'm just noticing a little odd things about the uh, animations here and there. But that's okay. Oh, whoops. Bag, right? Bag. Balls. Use it. Alright. Chain monk was caught. Data got added. The length of a chin young stripe determines its authority in a group. If it spots a predator, it shrieks loudly to warn the others. Yeah. What's the spell shriek? What the god? <laughs> so you're getting experience points for catching folks, huh? What a load of hooey. What kind of garbage is that? Whoops, my anarchy symbol. You need a trainer, I just started two. Last Lynette would like to battle. Out and... Oh, that guy's cute. Not very effective. Get wrecked. Let's do that. It looks like I'm not really going to outspeed much, which is not too fortunate. But I suppose that's fine. Out and paint it. Level 6? Alright, that's good. Hundred and twenty bucks. Man, what kind of hooey is it that I... Berries. Yeah, give me them. So 
soft and earthy state. Okay, that'll be a shortcut for later. Very Dark Souls. The Dark Souls of Pokemon, for sure. Okay, let's see what's in this grass. Aw, Burby. That's a cute... That's a cute one. I like that. I'm gonna catch you, too. Gotta be gentle. Pokeball, go. Nice. That makes me happy. The Eden Bird Pokemon. Yeah, I'll name him Blipper. I don't know why, it just feels right. You know, it's one of those things where it's like, that's a blooper right there, you know? You do look like a Steve. A potion. I will not be buying potions in this one. Pokemon isn't too, too hard. I mean, this game can be very, very easy. Hey, Alfred just got a new Pokemon. Let's see how it does. School kid Taff? Taff, sure. Jim uh -huh. Go, Bolty. Get him. I don't have a backpack. I should get a sporty little backpack. You know? Tackle. Ooh, it's a crit. Ah, <laughs> uh, served. Uh -huh. I will switch. Oh, it didn't heal them. Hmm, that isn't great. Well, maybe it won't be too bad. Actually, when I paralyzed that thing, it would have been a perfect opportunity to... It's uh, a beautiful sound you have. Ghost, huh? Alright. Guess we'll be uh, switch training then. Switch training, for those who don't know, is when you constantly uh, switch your Pokemon's out. So one will gain the benefits from the other's battles. I can just use a tackle. No need to get fancy, and I may as well save my ammunition since I don't intend to head back. Not as strong as I'd hoped. 200 poke. Ah, uh, sorry, Chim Young. But you must die. No one's taking you to the. Pokemon Center. Uh -huh. A goal, huh? Uh -huh. I just realized how low energy I actually really am. Sorry about that. I should be uh, popping off, ready to go. Alright, let me see here. The Agar? Alright, a little bit of a waste, but that's okay. I'll save the rare candy for later. When it's easy to level up like now, it doesn't really matter. But later, I will absolutely need rare candies. Hey, my recording crashed, but luckily nothing else did, so uh, this is the end of the episode. I walked into a guy's house, and that's where we'll pick up the next episode. Play the outro now. This is really dumb. This is really weird. <laughs> Ooh.